Want to make sure you never miss a Kindly Kian video again? Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell to turn on notifications. Ooh, here we go. Let's do it. Let's fight the giant squid. Let's do it. Oh, oh. Oh, I think I murdered it. I am Kindly Kian and welcome back to Feed and Grow Fish. Now you probably noticed some strange red text here on this title screen. And as you can see, this directs us to a YouTube channel. Now this is a group of individuals, I believe, who have successfully modded Feed and Grow Fish. And they've created this mod that does a lot of really, really cool stuff. So I will have a link in the description down below to their YouTube channel. But without further ado, let's check out this really cool mod. So, I think we're going to start out on the river level because I honestly very, very rarely play the river level. And we're going to show you guys here what this mod can do. It's actually really cool. So, if I go into the fish select menu, you probably already noticed there's a whole bunch of weird text up in the upper right hand corner. Check this out. Basically, we have access to every single fish that is in this game. How crazy is that? Because, you know, typically you can't play as every single fish. There's a lot of like non-player fish, I guess, like a jellyfish. You can't be a jellyfish. That's against the rules. Not in this mod. Oh, look at a baby penguin. It's a little baby fuzzy baby baby penguin. I don't know why I'm talking like that. It's weird. Evil King Crab, I don't even know where you came from. You freak me out. I don't like the way you're looking at me. How crazy is this? So let's just go through this. Uh, tr trilobite? What, what, what even are you? You don't belong here. What? I don't understand. Uber. You call your Uber and you get one of these. That would be weird. Look at all these guys. Oh, oh my gosh. Squid, a squid. For real? Where did this squid come from? Th is this seriously in the game? I did not know that this guy even existed, to be perfectly honest with you. And that's kind of embarrassing. But we can play as the squid now. That's crazy. Let's continue exploring what, a zombie. You don't look like a zombie. You're adorable. Why are you called a zombie? Look at you. I don't know if I want to find out why they're called a zombie. Maybe that fish loves to eat brains. Vampire leech. Why? I, I mean, that's cool. I just, I, there's there's so much going on here. Oh, look, we got the, the bone bebos and the robot bebos are separated, which is interesting. Why do you have people teeth? Th this guy has straight, like, human teeth. That's freaky. I don't like that. Make that go away. You're you're adorable. You just look so happy. There's Dory. So so wonderful. A lot of these guys we can play as though. Uh, the mantis shrimp, barracuda, Norway redfish, uh, zebra fish. That's that's kind of cool. Uh, the salmon. A lot of these guys you can play as. The megaloraptus. Man, this guy's scary. He, he freaks me out. What about this guy? I don't even remember. Is this a swamp? creature i don't know i don't even know there's so many remember a galliosaurus that's one of the new reptile fish d lizard monsters i don't know is it a gal a galliosaurus i don't even know how to say that name but he looks real cool kledge nice it's just kledge oh the seal what he plays the seal and also i'm noticing that do i just have like unlimited coins is that what's going on so like th these cost money but i can i can play as them regardless because i haven't played this at all so can i just have infinite money that that's pretty cool too that makes my life a lot easier i gotta say why are there oh there's baby whale shark interesting okay there's the old school great white shark oh my gosh he looks real grumpy mosasaurus we can play as mosasaurus what Oh my gosh, okay, this is like really, really cool, Chronosaurus. We can play as the sperm whale. Oh man. Oh, tell me, Mega. Megalodon. Yes! We can play as as Megalodon on the on the swamp level. That doesn't even make sense. Let's just let's just try. Let's see what's going on here. This is gonna be weird. What hello? Where am I? Oh my gosh. Am I I'm too big. I'm inside the ground. I what? What is happening? I can't slow down, please, Meg. Meg, slow down. You're you're getting out of control. Oh, 
I, I'm like inside of the Megalodon's face. This is what the inside of a Megalodon face looks like. I don't know if I like this. Okay, I, oh, I'm just, am I just eating everything? Yeah, okay, everything's getting eaten. That's, that, <laughs> this is so weird. If you were the stomach of a Megalodon, this is what you would see. Just everything in your way getting consumed in an instant. Okay, you need to slow down, buddy. Okay, okay, all right. Let's see, can I can I zoom out here? Check check you out, okay, all right. Okay, zoom out a little bit, a little bit more, a little bit more. Okay, there we go. We got a nice shot of Meg right there. Look at him, hanging out in the swamp, or the river, because why not? So this is what I'm talking about. This mod, so cool. This is really, really cool. You can do a lot of stuff with this mod, but this is only the beginning. Check this out. Now I'm gonna go into spectate mode and does that kill the make that doesn't, does it kill the Megalodon? Are you dead or are you just, you just float? Oh my gosh. That's a real dead Megalodon. My bad. Sorry about that, Meg. So you probably noticed this little menu text up in the upper right hand corner. This gives us the ability to spawn creatures on the fly, which seems so cool. You can set the level that they start at. So like, for instance, let's just go down to the, the lowly Nautilus and we can spawn one level 20 Nautilus. That's a, that's a level 20 Nautilus. Now we can adjust that, right? So I can go down. You can see the number going down so I can spawn a level one Nautilus. Look at them, they're mommy and daddy. Mommy and daddy. No, that's mommy and baby. Oh my gosh, that, that Nautilus is eating the remains of the Megalodon. Oh, oh yeah, everything. Okay, that's, that's kind of scary. Yeah, okay, we've just created the world's most deadly Nautilus ever but yeah so like we can spawn these guys on the fly but check this out you can also change the power level so the power level is basically how fast the creature gets spawned into the world let me demonstrate watch i've set it to 20 boom so now i basically have a nautilus cannon i can go up even more let's let's continue this chaos let's go up to like 50 Okay, level 50. Look, <laughs> it's like a homing torpedo. Oh my gosh, <laughs> guy. Oh man, okay. And now you can also spawn multiple at the same time. So all I have to do is press the number key. So this spawns one, but if I press two, it spawns two at the same time. And I press three, spawns three at the same time. If I hold zero, it will spawn a billion and look at this what am i even doing anymore i am filling the river with nautilus because why not you guys know how much i love to mess around with games and make them do things that they're not supposed to do so this is definitely exactly what i love to do like we've just filled the river with <laughs> Nautilus, what? What is even happening anymore? Oh my gosh. Yeah, and as you can tell, uh, the game is really, really upset with me and I could understand why. Uh, yeah, there's a really big one over there too. And, and so that's the even crazier thing. So if I level up this guy, if I change this to level 20, I can spawn giant Nautilus a billion times over. Like, that's terrifying, the kind of power that I now have. I'm gonna just spawn one. I just spawned a level 50. I don't want the torpedo cannon anymore. Can we can we cool this down a little bit? Can we lower the power of our of our spawning power? That made no sense. But it sorta did. Kinda. Anyways, look at this. Level 50 Nautilus. Yeah, it's just a giant monstrosity. And now I'm just gonna spawn like, I don't know. I, I don't even know what's happening anymore. There's probably a million of these things filling the ocean. And it's not even an ocean, it's a river. Oh yeah, okay, I've made a, a serious mess of this and I love it. Look at these guys, what, what are you guys doing? There's no more space for you guys anymore. Here, let's get out of the water, please. Can we, can we check this out? Oh. 
Oh, okay. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I did that. I, I shouldn't have done that. This is... There's not enough room for you guys. Here, I'll, I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Don't worry. I'll just spawn more. This will fix it. I promise. Is it fixed? Oh, it's not. It's not fixed. It's definitely not fixed. Not fixed. Oh, okay. That one is flying. That's incredible. Now, now we've discovered the first flying Nautilus the world has ever seen. So that's, that's pretty amazing. I'm very excited about that. Oh, oh my gosh. What a mess. What an absolute mess. A glorious mess that I created. So there is just a small taste of the kind of power that we now have. So let's get out of here. We've we've turned this into just an absolute disaster. Let's go back into one of the other maps. Why don't we just go into the great map here? I was thinking, you know, it might be kind of crazy to spawn a bunch of Megalodon. I mean, we can basically do anything that we want. I actually want to try playing as the, the squid, because that seems kind of cool. That's something that I've never experienced before. Life is a squid. He's so big. All right, let's 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 try it out. What do you even do? How do you how do you live your life? Oh, uh, OK, I just I just murdered that Bebos. Did I? Can I even eat stuff? Oh, oh, my. What? Oh, oh, my gosh. No, this is not normal. You can't do this normal. What is... Why can I do this? Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Can you just zoom out forever? Okay. That's super weird. Uh, can I can I come back now? Hello? Thank you for the drone shot. But I would like to return to the ocean. To live my life as a weird, weird squid. Okay. So, we are now a squid. And oh my god. Gosh, that is nasty. If real, Ugh. I would not want to get eaten by a squid. It's just, just saying, throwing it out there. Doesn't seem like a very pleasant experience. One XP. Thank you. Should we try and fight the Megalodon? Oh my gosh. Megalodon versus the giant squid. That sounds incredible. Oh, this is so good. Now, I don't know if there's a way to actually change the level of my of my creature. I don't know if there's a way to hack that. There probably is. I mean, it seems like you can do just about anything with this mod, but I don't know how to do that. I would love to make myself like level 50 to try and take down the Megalodon, but regardless, I want to see what this guy can do. We could even go after the Prognathodon, but let, let's start. Let's start a little bit smaller here. Let's try this guy. Let's see what happens if we if we bite down on this guy. Let's get him. Yo, you're not getting away, buddy. Oh, 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 this is not good. I okay, that hurt. That hurt. Ouch. Ow! You ah! <laughs> I don't know if the squid is exactly the strongest creature uh, in the ocean here. Maybe, maybe taking on the megalodon isn't the best idea. Okay, so we've learned a valuable lesson. The the giant squid is he's not very strong. But I was actually thinking, you know, we can't change the level that we are, but we can change the level that we spawn. So. If I go through this menu here and I find myself the squid, let's see, there it is, squid, right there. Now, I can change this guy to level, like, 100, I guess. I mean, level 50 is probably going to be enormous. Level 1 was already huge. So if he's level 100, I don't even know what to expect here. But at the very least, we can spawn it. Spawn 1. Okay. Okay, we've created... Oh, oh. My gosh, we, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's absolutely beautiful. But I didn't want to spawn it over here. I want to spawn it. Oh, Megalodon. You, oh, oh, is this going to happen? This is going to happen? Come on, squid. Squid. No. Go, yes. He's turning. Have they have they made eye contact? You guys have to fight. You, you have to fight. Are you really Megalodon? Like, I don't even believe... No, you're not Megalodon. You're just Great White Shark. I, I was looking at that. I was like, wait a second. You're you you're too small. You're not cool enough. Are you okay there, squid dude? I, uh, I don't, I don't know if he's okay. 
He doesn't look okay. You don't look okay. Have I mentioned that y you don't seem okay? Okay, I got this. I got this. I got it figured out, guys. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be the Megalodon. I'll be the monster of the sea. And I'm gonna fight this giant level 100 squid and see what happens. I have a feeling that I'll be- that I'll win. That's- that's my uh, guess here at the begin- oh my gosh, two Megalodons. It's beautiful. Let's go! Team Meg! I love it. Alright, I gotta find this giant squid. He's kind of hard to miss, to be honest. But I don't know where I spawned him. Where- where are you, buddy? Let's just peruse the ocean for a little bit here. Look out. Keep an eye out for, you know, a squid that's approximately the size of the Titanic. A any giant squids? Have you guys seen any giant squids lately? You, you guys down there? No? Oh! I think I found him! There he is! <laughs> Ooh, here we go! Let's do it! Let's fight the giant squid. Let's do it. Oh, oh. Oh, I think I murdered it. Like, really, really easily. Yeah, that was, that was almost embarrassing for the giant squid. Yeah, I mean, he tried. At least he, he thought about it. He definitely gave it some serious consideration. But uh, that's a super dead giant squid. Sorry about that, buddy. Uh, okay, uh, can we- actually, I hadn't even thought about this. Can we spawn creatures when we are not in spectating mode? So actually, I can probably set the level to, like, I don't know, I guess 200 now? We'll try 200, but I, honestly, I don't think the, the giant squid was designed to- to fight. He's a survivor, not a fighter. So, I don't think that he'll ever be able to take on the Megalodon. I mean, the giant squid was way, way bigger than we were, but we killed it in two bites. <laughs> that's, uh, that's not too good for the giant squid. So, I'm gonna spawn a giant squid. Uh, that totally works. Level 200 giant squid right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is horrifying. What in the world is happening? I just, I can't. So, I want to see if he'll even attack me. Like, can you, can you attack me here? Or are you just a confused and lost soul? You don't know what's going on, do you? You are very, very confused. And you know, honestly, I, I understand. I mean, you came into this world as a very large creature. I'm gonna, I'm gonna swim in your mouth, okay? You're not attacking me. Nothing's happening. Oh, wait. No, 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 nothing's happening. <laughs> What? Come on, giant squid. You gotta be cooler than that. Nothing. Just, just a big old blob. He's a big old friendly blob. Well, now I feel bad that I'm about to murder him. But only a little bit. Because, uh, I'm still doing it. I'm, yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, that's a, that's a dead squid. That's a real dead squid. This is gonna give us a ton of XP. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at all that XP. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is, that's too much. That's too much XP. The Megalodon, he's too powerful. He just, he's too powerful. Too much winning. You gotta slow down on the winning front, all right, Meg? You're too good. Look at this guy. Oh man, this is so cool being able to play as the Megalodon and fight giant squids. I love it. What else can we spawn? Let's see. A swamp crab? Sure! I'll spawn a level 200 swamp crab on top of my head? Why? B because... He's... He's like, how did I get here? This is not my swamp! This is not the swamp that I ruled. Yeah, you're in the big pond now, buddy. He's freaking out. He doesn't know how to handle this situation. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Unbelievably awesome. A baby barracuda. A level 200 baby barracuda. Like... Why? <laughs> Again, I think the more correct answer is why not? Oh my gosh, that just looks ridiculous. And I love it. He's cute and terrifying at the same time. It's beautiful, and this crab over here is just lost and confused. He doesn't know how to handle the situation. This is amazing. I think I'm gonna go back into spectate mode. Let's do some crazy spawning shenanigans. Oh. A couple of dead megalodons just floating around. That's morbid. Oh, and they just turned into meat. Lo lots of, lots of meat. All right, what else should we spawn? 
baby. Just, I'm just gonna spawn a baby? That, that, okay, you're a baby. You're a very, very big baby. Just throwing that out there. What is this? I can spawn like a hundred of these in a second. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. It's the most conflicted fear I've ever had. It's the cutest fear I've ever faced. What is happening? This mod is amazing. Let's spawn some zombies. There you go. You got a bunch of baby zombies. Look at all of them. They're everywhere. I, I, I don't know what else to say. It's just, it's magical. This is just magical. Oh my goodness. Buried in an army of giant baby fish. It's horrifying and delightful at the same time. Pure magic. Gosh. What a beautiful mess. What a beautiful, beautiful mess. All right, what else do we got? Vampire leech. We can actually play as the vampire leech. That seems kind of cool. Oh my gosh, we can spawn a bunch of Bebos? A bunch of bone Bebos. What the heck? We've, we're gonna ruin the ecosystem here. Oh my gosh. The giant bonefish army. Oh, oh no. What have I done? Like, seriously. I don't even think they know what to do. They're, are they just, are they just chomping? They're just chomping. Wh why? What are you guys doing? I kind of want to spawn one of these guys next to like, Megalodon, see what happens. Let's go robo mode. Let's see, we got robo bebos, we do. So I can spawn one. There's one giant robo bebos. He has no idea what to do. They just stand there and chomp. It's kind of weird. Yeah, might might be a little bit broken. Just going out on a limb and saying that the game probably doesn't quite understand how to handle all this. I can't imagine why. Seems like a perfectly normal occurrence. Everyday thing. Happens all the time. Here, Meg. Here, fight. Fight this guy. Do it. Do it. You guys need to fight. Robo Bebos versus Megalodon. Go. Oh! <gasps> No, Robo Bebos! You're gonna die! Oh, did he kill him? No, fight! Fight, Robo Bebos! He's, he's behind you! You gotta turn around, dude! You got to turn around! You're not, you're not gonna make it, dude. You're not gonna make it if you don't fight back. He, he's not fighting back. He's just accepting his fate and just letting Megalodon rip him to pieces that was my child. You just murdered my robot son. You hurt me. You hurt me, Megalodon. All right, well, let's let's lower the level a little bit. And uh, before we end this episode, I feel like we need to we need to try and break the game here. So let's go to like level 100. And uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. What? What is what is even happening? I don't I have no idea what just happened. I mean look at this. The sound stopped. I can't here wait. Can we can we can we exit? Oh my. Well, I was gonna say let's break the game. It looks like we already did. Amazing. Truly amazing. Let's let's start over then, maybe? I'll go back to the menu. Go go single player. Let's go to should we go to the ocean map? Nah, let's go to the great map. Let's do the great map. We're gonna fill this thing with, I don't know. What should we fill it with? Okay, we're back. Everybody's happy. Things are things are moving again. All right, that's good to see. I'm glad to see that. Let's go up here and uh, let's just look upon our canvas before we destroy it. So there's our there's our beautiful ocean. Let's go to level 200. I, I'm gonna take it back to level 200. I'm also gonna up the power of my of my launching spawning ability. You know what? Why don't we get real crazy? Should we go 300? Let's go 300. Let's test the limits of feed and grow fish. All right, what are we gonna spawn? What seems like oh, we're gonna fill the ocean with level 300 dories? It's happening. This is it's gonna happen right now. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Go, Dory. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, what have I done? Uh, Dory, 
you know, I recommend that you uh, just keep swimming. Oh! How did that happen? Did I... Did the Dories not make it? Maybe it's because I spawned them too, too high up in the air. They couldn't quite make it. And they, uh, they turned into that. My bad. Sorry about that, Dory. It's okay. Everything's okay. I'm gonna spawn some more. Spawn some over there. <laughs> this is incredible. I love it. Spawn some over here. I was gonna spawn them on the go, you know? While I head over in this direction, why not spawn some more Dories? Oh, what a mess. What an absolute mess. All right, let's go underwater. Let's see what this looks like. Oh gosh. Oh, there's, there's no, there's no room. There's no safety. <laughs> Look at, he's just got that little mouth. And there's a, there's Prognathodon, very, very confused as to what is happening. And, uh, well, it's understandable. This is definitely understandable, buddy. They're, they're looking at each other. They're just, they're just looking. Just looking at each other. Trying to figure things out. It's amazing. Just amazing. Nature in its, in its purest form. Right there. Oh. Well, we've got a bit of, a bit of space over here, so we better fill it up. Get some more dories going. There you go. Can never have enough Dory. That's what I've always said. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, my poor computer. Oh, it's beautiful. Hello, D Dory's eyeball. It's nice to meet you. But guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. I can almost guarantee that we're going to come back to Feed and Grow Fish with this mod. Because this mod is amazing. So let me know if you guys have any ideas for things that we can do, shenanigans that we can get into with this mod. But I have a few ideas bouncing around in that noggin of mine, so I think we'll uh, we'll come back to this in the future. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.